Morning guys, tell you what, what a beautiful morning at Nora Head here, check out that backdrop behind me, bloody beautiful, yeah at Nora Head here and we're going to be doing a bit of bait collecting today and fishing and we're just going to be seeing what's available on the rock shelf, should be crabs and gungee and yeah we'll just see what's available, mainly going to be targeting crabs and hopefully pick up a couple of brim grow bar and yeah, we'll just see what's out there really. Everything likes crabs, even snapper. So we'll have a crack and get into it nice and early. I've already collected a couple of crabs, so I'll show you them in a minute. Quiet rock shelf here. Had to come around the back here because it was very rough around the front there. So we'll just have a wander around, see if we can find some crabs or something to put on for bait. It looks like I just saw one under here, good sized crab. That was a good start almost like it was set up Looked like a big crab actually so um they're good brim or rope of great bait or something i suspect Let's see if he's what's gonna happen when i lift this rock there he is got him Nice crab there, rock crab. That'd be a top bait. So I've got ice in the esky, so what I'll do, I'll just whack him on the ice and he'll go to sleep till I'm ready to use him. We'll try and gather a few baits up. Oh, he's trying to get me right next to the nail there. They can bite you, so you gotta be a bit careful. Yeah, I've got some ice in there, just drinks, no bait or anything, just, uh, he'll go to sleep. Probably a minute or something in the cold. Yeah, it's just a little one, but it's a snack little bait for something. There was a bigger one under this rock. Lift it, it's a big bugger. Oh, there he goes. He's on my foot, the silly crab. Got him, there's another beauty. Another beauty of a crab. Oh, he's trying to get me there. Hmm. Oh, big one. Big crab. Ooh, I've got to watch the claws on him. Big purple daddies. If I can lift it, it's a big bugger. Yeah, there's a couple of good ones in there. Oh, look, a massive one. And I missed a couple there, but a, I've got a massive one here. I don't know where those other couple went. Got one. There's another one. Got a few good ones there. Gotta watch this big one. If he bites me, I'll know it. Yeah, a couple of good buggers. Trying to get me furiously. All right, we'll have a fish now. That's pretty easy to get those guys. About five minutes gathering, got about eight crabs, I think. You gotta watch those big nippers, they'll get you. Plenty of good sized crabs in here. Yeah, crabs everywhere. Whoa. They'll go to sleep soon on the ice.
All right, we've got our fresh crab on there. Look at that. I'd eat that, he's all steep fried. Certainly wouldn't knock it back. You know what I mean? You've got a few bites and yeah, dummy quick smart. Another bit of crab on. Might actually make him a little bit more presentable. Take a couple of legs off there. Beautiful. Broke a couple of legs off so they can get it down a bit easier. Jeez, they love those crabs. Absolutely smashing me on those crabs. Oh, still got a bit left. Get him back out there. Whoa. There we go, beautiful drummer. Look at that. <laughs> this guy nearly snapped me off. I gave him one second putting the camera on, maybe a couple of seconds, and he had me straight in the reef, straight away. And this is only a small one, so you can imagine the big ones, how hard they go. There we have it. Beautiful little drummer. Oh, I dropped him. Oh no. We'll see it here. Beautiful little drummer. I'm gonna let him go. I may keep one or something for the table, but nice little guy. And as I said, that went hard. 20 pound braid, 30 pound trace, nearly busted me off. Imagine the big ones. All right, let's get back into it. Okay, mate. They love these little rock shelves. You'd be surprised how shallow these guys can go. They really can go shallow. There you go. Off he goes. Straight into that little cave right there. And he's hiding there. There he is right there, right on that little cave. That's what they do, they just hang under little rocks like that, in the shallows. You wouldn't even think fish would hide there, but yeah, they love that sort of stuff. All right, let's try and get a bigger one. That was good fun. Another one. Oh, gotta get me out of there. Got a brim this time. Got a variety coming in. Good to see. Beautiful clean brim. Nice and silver. Not much black on him at all. Lived most of his life on the beaches by the look of it. Absolutely gorgeous. Good to see. Shows everything loves the crabs. Oh, got another one. Jeez, there's 50 fish around. Oh, got a bit of weight this one. Oh no. Yeah, another drummer. Beauty. Bloody hell, killing it. What a beautiful little drama, look at that. They're beautiful. They're quite a pretty fish. They're very, very rugged, more rugged looking than the black fish. Tougher looking sort of fish. Thicker, beefier head on them. They just look like a 
yeah, more robust blackfish really. I've been pretty good with that little little one over there. Okay, there we go. Nice little fella. Anyway, we'll let him go. I might actually let him go on this side just so he doesn't spook the school. Tell the brim because didn't try to bury me straight in the reef with all the bonus. Jeez, it's good fishing here. Love this sort of stuff. Nice rocks under my feet. Yeah, just a little fella that one. Probably the illegal one, but yeah. Got one here. Oh, it's taking me out the rocks. Oh, big brim. Look at that. Big bloody brim. Bloody beauty. Can't complain about that. Smash me nearly straight away as soon as that crab hit the water. of the day so far bloody beauty smashed that crab as soon as it hit the water it was just absolutely smashed it and yeah put up a great little fight good variety three brim two drummer it's looking good it's only early too bloody beautiful all right i'm gonna let this one go to him Beautiful brim. Alright, let's let him go. Absolute smash that crabby dude. around with whatever you hook on here because you're gonna get him in bloody fast oh big drummer big bloody drummer well not that big but <laughs> they're getting bigger slowly bloody beautiful fish after fish down here this is great fishing Beautiful drummer. Geez, they go hard in this shallow water. Have to really give them some stick when you hook them. Fishing the incoming tide here. About the last hour, the incoming tide now. Whoop. Yeah, there. Doesn't want to play the game with me. Beautiful looking fish, they really are. Anyway, let him go. Let's check that camera still. Yeah, we'll let that one go. Great sport fish they are. Bluey black colours. I'll let him go in this little trench over here actually. See if he goes under the same rock the other one went under. Nah, he's going out that one. Oh, got one. 
little drama. The little fella. Smallest. Oh, there he goes. Smallest one I've had today. Beached himself on that beach there. Oh, buddy, that didn't take long. Oh, hell, this feels like it's got the weight. Come on, get up, get up, get up, get up. These are dirty fighters, these drummer. Oh, hell. They do not muck around, these buggers. There's number five or six. Absolutely killing it. A lot of bites out there, heaps of bites. Good size drummers. They're all about a kilo. Anyway, I'm gonna, I'm gonna let this one go anyway. Young boy. See how long it's Oh, got him that time. Oh, they are thick out there at the moment, thick school. Oh, it almost got me in that rock shelf. Oh, yeah. One after another. Awesome fun. Awesome fun catching these. It really is. It's the smallest one yet. Whoa, whoa, whoa. They go straight for that rock wall. Those drummer dirty bloody fighters. Yeah, they go straight for that rock wall. Look how fat they are. Nice pale colour in this clear water. Pretty beautiful. Oh, oh that's alright. Off a bit now. Beauty. Oh, they're heavy. They're heavy buggers. They really are heavy buggers. They caught a lot. I don't know how many I caught now. Eight. A lot. Oh, a tiny one. Oh, he's got a big tumour off him. Look at that. Well, I never. Oh, he's got some kind of big bloody zist or something on him. I don't know what the go with that is. I might actually pop it on him. Looks like it'd be under a lot of pressure. Feels soft, so I assume it's a zist or something. Let's see if we can pop it. Yep, full of puffs, look at that. Full of puffs. Squirting water out of it, look at that. Anyway, hopefully he heals up good now. Probably glad I caught him. Might fix him up. <laughs> oh, they're getting smaller. Tide's dropping. So yeah, they're getting smaller. Good fun still. That's it guys, another adventure done. It's pretty good in the end. We got heaps of drummer, heaps of brim, and yeah, plenty of bites, non-stop action. That incoming tide's a go, top of the tide. As soon as it turns out going, really starts to die off the bite. So yeah, incoming tide in those shallow areas, can't beat it. Crabs, free bait, good way to fish actually, very relaxing. All right, guys, if you ain't fishing, you're wishing, and I'll see you on the water. Catch us.